Hi guys. So this is for today's chapter. It's a factory top view machine edition. So we we'll discuss about all how we can upload and download the program and how we can use the software, how we can work on it. So this is transfer utility. That is the way how we can download and upload. Which program we I want to download on my HMI so I can browse from here. Like I need to download this program. So I can download from here and if I want to upload the program first I have to browse from here with double click and go to here then upload so this is the way how to upload and download now <coughs> application manager restore runtime file like I have a backup um, that is a runtime file and to open here next So this is the way how we can open a runtime file on my factory top studio.
so it's take uh, time to upload the project and So guys, this is the actual way how we can use a runtime application, I mean runtime backup to open in Factory Top Studio Machine Edition. So here I can already complete my runtime file. So how I can check it out, go to file, open application. So this is Gaurav AV Mac. So the last option with Factory Talk View 8.0 So it's a message which is actually it showed that uh, you created that software is in uh, you created that backup in 7.0 version and you are using 8.0 so that is a first message so just go to yes after check all the things now it's take ta little time to open that backup So it's a complete application functions of Factory Talk View Studio. Here I can, if you want to check all the displays, so I mean all the parameters, displays, values, I can go here, displays. It's all displays as, as you can see. So 
so you can check all its <coughs> read address and write address so go to connections So you can see that this is a write or read address of uh, this standby logic as I used a uh, maintain push button properties and this is how we can check PLC program read and write address. So for check all the parameters, all the read write values of PLC you have to check you have to first browse and refresh all folder and will connect with the PLC or uh, HMI backup system so Okay, so you can use this rough paper also in program like this. See, it's a rough side paper. So I can check all the things I have to. after complete the backup while you complete all the things and displays so what we will do we have to create once again a runtime file for HMI settings because HMI can support only a runtime file and this is not a runtime file we are using a runtime file converted into the backup which it can open on that is a MER file or runtime file we are using a runtime file for factory talk view studio and while we using a backup file for HMI we create it into MER file so I acknowledge once again MER file is for HMI and runtime file is for factory talk view studio so after complete this backup I am going to create runtime application so this is a 1.8.0 save so it, it will create once again a that is a mere file After complete this file, we can use this file directly to the HMI so pen drive or this one software I already told you. Um, that is transfer utilities. 